Here we are at part 57 of my video walkthrough for The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. And we have just entered the Stone Tower Temple. This place is very creepy. Very weird. <laughs> ah. Stupid enemies. They put a switch on the eyeball. Okay. Fun times. Pick up some, uh, yeah, random assorted consumables. And we find Stray Fairy number one! And off this way we go. Yeah, there's a bunch of these annoying little exploding enemies. And yeah, we need these little boxes to hold down switches, so I think there's two of them in there. Oh, well. Because I failed to shoot him. Exploding mice! Why? And in order to open the door out of this room, we're going to have to hold all the switches down, so... Guess what we get to play? Fortunately, they don't make you use this too much in the tower here, so... Or, the temple. Well, I have almost all the mass, don't I? <laughs> One more switch. The door is now open. And no, even with the bunny hood, you can't run out the door before it shuts. Be nice. Alright, we got a few flying enemies and whatnot around here, but shouldn't be a problem. Alright, locked door. But before we can open the locked door, we're gonna have to go downstairs. Before we can do that, we need to blow a hole in the ground. Creating a light source. Ow. Alright, head to want this one edge of the room and you can just barely see the hookshot point. Getting us our second stray fairy. Alright. Oh, not close enough. Use our shield to get the sunblock out of the way. Too much item switching! And the power of the Gorgon will allow us to walk through the lava without taking any damage. Awesome! Uh oh. It's a treasure chest. Woohoo! The map! But wait! There's more! We need to take off these statues. Which, um, after aggravating them, you can generally just roll into a little Goron ball here and you'll be alright. <laughs> Even if they explode. Alright, 
Alright, we got two more. One over there, one over here. And after killing all four of the Armos statues, we get another chest! Woohoo! A small key! And what a coincidence! We just happened to need it right there. Huh. Well, I don't see no beams of light anywhere to activate that, so... I guess it's off into the water we go. Who better to go swimming with than Zora Power? Yeah, let the little hand thing grab you. And it'll fling you up on top of the ledge here. Awesome. And yeah, we need to uh, put that switch over there for later. Can't get that chest now, but we need to activate it for later. Oh, look, and there's another chest here. Woohoo! All kinds of good count stuff going on. But now, since we don't want the hand to grab us, we're gonna have to get rid of it. No problem. Hmm. A switch on the ceiling. That's weird. Wonder how we're gonna hit that. Whoa! Well, there's a big old room here. The switch surrounded by spikes. Ooh, look at my craftiness. And it spawns a treasure chest on the ceiling. What? Okay, this is just weird. How am I supposed to open stuff on the ceiling? I don't know. Whatever. I'm sure it'll all make sense in time. Alright, now we have a really crappy puzzle here. Uh, what we have to do is shine the beam of light, or try to anyway, on the mirror. And the mirror will kind of like store light in it. Don't ask me how that works. And then we can run over here and use the beam of light generated by the mirror to activate the switch. Oh boy! Alright, more treasure. It's compass power! Run, Link! Ah! Didn't run quite fast enough. But, luckily we got a key earlier so we can proceed further. Maybe? <laughs> oh, looky, there's a switch. I think I forgot to hit that one time. And it's another treasure chest on the ceiling. Um, ah, uh, this is weird. Anyway, moving on. Gonna need Goron power for this one. This big crazy statue thing in the middle here. If we knock it out of our way, it'll give us some light. And yeah, we get constantly assaulted by shadow creatures while we're in here, just to make it fun. Let's see, one of these is a switch. I think it's that one. There we go. And inside we get Stray Fairy number three. And we have another one of these mirror puzzles we have to deal with. Only this time it's kind of tricky because we have the shadow creatures that just constantly spawn while we're in here. Ah! Fail! Didn't get enough charge. Okay. 
not being able to hold my controller still. There we go. Oh, oh, oh. Come on, Link. Hold it, hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Eh. 